How's it going guys? Update here. Um, ignore my voice. I am getting over a sickness. So I may sound horrible. But that's besides the point. Uh, I updated his enclosure. The uh, dwarf puffer. Or I should say aquarium. Sorry. Uh, I updated it. I put him in an old... Uh, it's like a hexagon. Octagon, hexagon, one or the other. I don't really care. Um, just because it looks better. My opinion, it's up higher and is, I don't know, it looks actually a lot better to me. It's not as long, but it, he does have a lot more height. So here, just a quick look in there. And there he is. He's doing well as ever. I did also put my last remaining nearite snail in here. He floated somewhere down to the bottom, so probably see him later. And then here is the 55. Uh, I don't think you guys seen it like this yet. It's half done. I got aquascape soil finally. And I still only, I only got a 20 pound bag, so I only did half of it. So I just did half stone, half. Um, half rock. I'm going to get more, probably two more 20 pound bags and then more plants as well. And then I am going to try, I am going to do his tank into a aquascape. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a hardscape or aquascape. Um, but once this is done, then I will, uh, I'll work on his after I finish this. I got some wood in there. I think I had that in there last time. And then I have Three, like three zebra daniels. I'm gonna attempt to scoop up and put in the puffer tank and see how that does. It's just gonna be an experiment. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'll be back. Put Daniels in here. That didn't work very well. They were just scaring the heck out of Emerald. Man, where are you? Focus. He's so tiny, the camera does not want to focus. There, that's probably all the better it's gonna get. But here's his aquarium. Um, there's just some pothos I have up here growing. It's not actually like completely submerged. The leaves are all completely out of the water so that it won't drown and pothos will grow pretty much anywhere if you've ever kept it you'll know that um so it's just have the roots in the water and it's probably a new stem and a leaf here and it wasn't like that when i put it in so i know that it's healthy and it's living and then here's just a quick look of the 55 so far i think i said before that i'm going to make this into a aquascape it's a paycheck by paycheck build, so I'm going to get more, I need to get like two more bags of soil. This is a 20 pound bag right here, and uh, I covered about half the tank, so then it's just rocks, but I am going to get the other soil like I said so, and then more plants obviously, these are the only plants I have, I'm going to make him do with it, and then just show you the catfish this is a uh, clay pot that I uh, cut the bottom off with a dremel and then sanded it down to where it was so really smooth and couldn't wasn't jagged or sharp and he basically lives in this thing he loves it I am gonna get a bigger one uh, I think I might do another one or hear that or I'm gonna get a black PVC pipe and put in here black because it would just look great with green plants and a black substrate and that would be for him mainly I mean the other fish could swim through if they wanted to but they don't <laughs> he's basically the owner of that um, so yeah this is gonna be an aquascape at some point I am gonna do his aquarium I'm not sure if I'm gonna do a hardscape or if I'm gonna do an aquascape with his 
we'll find out maybe put some like nano shrimps in there and stuff. I think that'd be really cool. I don't think he would really bother them any. And I don't think they'd bother him. I do have a neorites down in here. And when I first introduced them, he did keep nipping at the snail a lot. But he's basically left them alone now. So yeah. Stay tuned guys. I will have more of this, I promise. I just gotta get the stuff for it. Let me since he's right out of the open, get a good shot of the golden gourami. He's still little, he hasn't really gotten any bigger since I've gotten him. I only had him for maybe the past two, two and a half weeks maybe, so anyway, so full grown, he'll be maxed out probably about six, maybe seven inches in length, maybe two inches tall. He's pretty awesome, I love him. I think he's pretty, he's very pretty. And then I am wanting to get, I think I might get a school of tiger barbs in this aquarium set up and see how that does. So yeah, stay tuned guys. Hope you like it. This was just a bit of an update video. Talk to you later.